well, tonight we are um, talking about Happy Meals. What what memories do you have of Happy Meals, Kim? Do you have any? Never being allowed to get one. <laughs> <laughs> With four children, we got a small fry and split it between all four of us. So, <laughs> Did you walk uphill both ways? <laughs> I will say that... Um, there were maybe like two times in my childhood I can remember getting a Happy Meal, and it was the best day ever. You yeah. Know? yeah, yeah, we didn't do Happy Meals all that much, but yeah. that's what that's what makes it special, right? Um, I remember when we did the very first escape plan. That was one of the things that yes. I did. Was I right? I think it was like do something that's inappropriate for someone of yeah. your age, and yeah. ordered Happy Meals, and uh, and that we was got rad. Barbie toys, which was a little bit of a. I still, I still got that necklace. But it was a Barbie necklace. Yeah. yeah. It's one thing that they've never really been great. The, the prizes. Yes. They're really on par with the... Um, the box. The uh, Cracker Jack prizes. It's, yeah. The idea yeah. is better than reality. Yeah. And that's... You know, now that I'm saying this, this is exactly why we do Wonder and Whimsy Society. Not the only reason. But, yeah. like, we just mailed out the boxes to everyone for the October mystery mailing. Yes. We do quarterly mystery mailings, and I hope, and we've gotten confirmation, but I hope... No, not everybody's gotten it yet. No, okay. but I, we've gotten confirmation from people who've received them yes. that it's they're good. Yes. Like, I hope that you don't have that disappointment of a Happy Meal toy. Oh, or a cracker jack. the Happy like, Meal toy disappointment. That's my point, is like, I, I want to... The anticipation is exciting. We talked about anticipation a few weeks ago, but like then to be able to follow it up with something that's actually cool mm -hmm. is, I think, where we try to right wrongs. Yes, right? and you know they're they're bringing up some really good points. You guys, you guys are um, Amanda Inman says the teeny beanies. That was one of the best. That things. was a high point. Wasn't yeah, it? the teeny beanies were huge. I know exactly what year that was. It was like nineteen. Uh, 96, 97, because I remember working and, and the people I worked with at the time were collecting them. It was a blast, right? And then... Um, Kathy Rose says in the early 60s, she had regular McDonald's meals pretty often. My mom didn't like to cook. See? And, and our, that's the yeah. thing is like her friends are probably like, lucky, right? Right. right. You know? So, but who else? Let's see. Someone else said, oh, Jody said the minion prizes this summer were awesome. So yeah, they hit some, they hit some, like Pretty when good. they partner with the right licensing team, I think is part yep. of it, you know? Mm -hmm. Um, and maybe it's just your preference, but I know so many times the kids will get like a toy and you're kind of like, what's, what's, I know there's a, um, a sound here. This one. Yeah, <laughs> and maybe it, you know maybe it's not about the toy it's about anticipating the toy so maybe the joy is still there but yeah uh, well it's good to know jen, jen says the box was the best this week you made me very happy and no disappointment yay so that's pretty cool yeah um lisa said i'm loving the red box <laughs> uh mary beth says the mystery mailing was awesome so much fun happy so birthday mary beth that's awesome red yeah. box is full of the best goodies cool i'm glad yeah. to hear that i'm glad yeah. to hear that um but yeah i wanted to give a little yeah. background where did on this happy come meals, from it's kind of yeah. yeah it's kind of fascinating so uh the happy meal was introduced in 1979 mm. which is only a year after uh I was born. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was, as I was in the middle of saying that, I'm like, am I not supposed to say that out loud? <laughs> Did he see his face? He was like I nervous. Was like, like, oh, I actually you... thought you were trying to think if it was you or me that was born. I, so that's funny. No, I was going to reference that you, but you, then you, you went right into it. So there you go. So uh, McDonald's was actually founded in 1955. So it was more than 20 years after McDonald's was founded okay. that the Happy Meal came about. Now, this is... Amazing. I did not know this. Okay. After McDonald's employee Yolanda Fernandez de Cofino created Menu Ronald, mm. which combined a menu hamburger, ah. small fries, and a small sundae specifically for young customers Aww. in Guatemala. Hmm. This is where the origins came from. In all Guatemala. right. The company's advertising executive, Bob Bernstein, brought the idea stateside and swapped out ice cream for toys. Ah. So, like, Bob Bernstein gets the credit because he he branded it. He called it Happy okay. Meals, but the idea hmm. menu Ronald is from Guatemala. Uh, a woman in, um, and I think if I, I don't have it here, but I think it was her husband was one of the owners of that franchise, uh, and she came up that's with it. So cool! Uh, wow. Bernstein often noticed his young son at the breakfast table pouring over the various items on cereal boxes. Hmm. 
story of my life. <laughs> uh, why not do that for McDonald's? The package is the key. He then called in his creative team and had them mock up some paperboard boxes fashioned to resemble lunch pails with the McDonald's golden arches mm-hmm. for handles. Mm-hmm. He then named it the Happy Meal, and it was successfully introduced with TV and radio spots and in in-store posters. Imagine like having to, to announce and advertise Happy Meals, like oh, to tell yeah. people what it is. That's That uh, tells you how far we've come. Yeah, started yeah. in the Kansas City market in 1977, and then the national rollout happened in 79. Hmm. So, and then the first toys, so we were talking about toys. Uh, the first one, they had like different things. They had either a McDoodler stencil, mm. a McWrist wallet, an ID bracelet, huh. a puzzle lock, a spinning top or a McDonald Land character eraser. What's a puzzle lock? It's probably like one of those like a uh, like things that unlock that like you twist it. Oh, uh, okay, and yeah. Um, and then, um, as we pointed out, I think Jody talked about the Minions. Mm-hmm. Happy Meal is often themed to promote a family-oriented film. The first one. Do you have, do you have any guess what the first movie themed? I'm gonna guess E.T. That's not a bad guess. Okay. That's not a bad guess. Does Maybe. anyone have a, a, a guess on what the first um, mm-hmm. movie that was promoted with Happy Meals? Um, we'll give you a second to chime in there. Mm-hmm. Um, I'll get back to that. So in 2011, they tried to make them happier. I'm mean, not happier, healthier. <laughs> happier, I guess. But add, that's when they added the apples. Okay. And they made the fries smaller. Okay. They, so to their credit, they didn't take the fries out. Yeah. They left them. It in is a tiny little them fry. Smaller in. portion. Yeah. Added in apples. Okay. Um, that was that was that. Mm-hmm. And then um, let's see. We're getting some. Okay. Yeah. Amanda guesses Aladdin. Which Aladdin is a good guess. guess. Not, yeah. It's, too, it's earlier than Aladdin. Okay. I'll tell you that it's earlier than Aladdin. Muppet Lisa, movie. Muppet movie, that's a good Which guess. reminds me, people were talking earlier in the chat about those glasses that the, the restaurants used to have. That yes. Were, but that didn't have anything to do with Happy Meals. No. You could just purchase Pizza a glass. Yes, meals. with those see, licensed uh, characters. Brenda says Star Wars, Ooh, and you guess. are very close. How can you be close to Star Wars and not Star- be Star Wars? Star Yes, Star Trek. <laughs> Star Trek, 1979. So that was like right away they went into wow. the thing. But the Star huh. Trek meal was the first promotion. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mep- um, Muppets is a good guess. I agree guess, with yeah. John because that was a big deal in the 80s, right? Yeah, Star, Star Wars was a good guess. It was about that time. And then uh, the last little note of trivia I have is that, uh, and I don't remember this, McDonald's 2014, they introduced a mascot to Happy Meals. Do you remember that? United 2014? States, 14, so six years ago, no. uh, and his name was Happy, huh. who originated in France as early as 20, 2009, oh, wow. but reactions were mixed with criticism that the mascot's design was too frightening. <laughs> too frightening. <laughs> Do you have a picture of this? I, I don't. Oh, I failed. Happy. I failed all of you. Oh. I failed you. I failed myself. <laughs> I was so excited to be able to share that tidbit. Heck yes, I did. I guess you did. You found us. <laughs> <laughs> you have to explain it. Oh, I apologize. Yeah. Maybe we could have a follow up next week. What? Why was he frightening? I mean, I don't even have any memories of Happy. To He's be honest, probably short lived. But uh, yeah. Hmm. Oh boy. Well, that was definitely when we had kids. So, but. Yeah, I bet if I radar. saw it, I'd recognize it. You think I so? Bet. Yeah. Like Paul, I love that. <laughs> Like Ronald wasn't scary. Um, this is a nice follow up to our clown discussion. Was that last week or the that week was before? Just last week. Yeah. 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 Well, you know, that's what it Interesting is. Interesting times. Yeah. 